Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Before we begin today's video, make sure you guys are going down below and smashing that subscribe button. Make sure you drop an early like as well. But in today's video, the Grau meta is back inside of Modern Warfare. The Grau is now again the best AR inside of multiplayer and Warzone. This thing absolutely shreds again. In my opinion, it never stopped shredding. But as we know, it all got that little nerf and people did stop using it. And the Bruin was the meta for a very, very long time. But I can tell you now, the Grau meta is back and it's beaming we are playing some multiplayer today this is the class up i'm going to be rocking for multiplayer the class up for warzone is a little bit different this is actually the variant you go uh, you unlock for completing the games of summit events if you can get a gold medal in every single event this is the variant you unlock very very cool looking growl pretty simplistic but still nonetheless very cool i've not seen anyone with this in game just yet actually and if you're looking for a warzone setup this is the warzone setup you can go ahead and use the best grouse setup for warzone absolutely shreds but like i did say just a second ago we are playing multiplayer today so let's hop straight into a game right now make sure you guys smash that subscribe button and i'll see you guys in the gameplay okay guys we are on shoot house playing a little bit of grind using this grouse setup this is probably my, one of my favorite grouse setups in the game right now the Grau is beaming again as well. It seems absolutely insane once again. Just like the old Grau did seem as well. Uh, I do prefer not using the um, Archangel Barrel. But for the sake of this video, I know it's a, probably a fan favourite barrel as well. And I'm getting beamed from somewhere. Teammates are going to save my life there. Uh, and it sort of just fits well with the variant. If I was to have the one I prefer on, which I can't remember which one it is. Uh, then it wouldn't have have the aesthetics of the variant so for the sake of it i thought i'd just leave it on and to be fair it works really really well definitely at range it's just so so good as you guys know so so it's such a clean iron sights nonetheless to be honest um but i prefer the one if you guys remember the uh we've got a VTOL. wow oh my god we're shredding oh my days we're gonna get taken out there which i, I don't mind we got the VTOL in uh, I do prefer the one on my SMG grow, so what should I call this? Just call it Junkyard. No one was popping up on the ping there, which was super strange. I have no idea why, but we'll roll with it anyway. But thank you guys ever so much recently for the support on the Phase 5 grind. Obviously, I've only uh, uploaded my introduction to Phase 5. Uh, just letting you guys know a little bit about myself if you are new to the channel. Uh, it did uh, bring a lot of new people to the uh, channel, to be fair. Not many subscribers, but based on the analytics alone, a lot of new people did come to uh, that video and check it out. So if you guys did subscribe from that video, then welcome. I am complimentating, if that's how you need to say that word. You know, I'm kind of undecided on what kind of content to upload. Uh, I've been discussing with uh, one of my friends, uh, YouTube friends, Moz. You might have heard me talk about him before. Uh, whether I was going to go for sniping content or just, you know, our regular content, you know, best class setups and, you know, what we're feeling in the game, like OP stuff. Uh, I tend to upload XP glitches and news and stuff. Uh, so, I think what we decided on was to just be ourselves, really, and I think that's probably the best bet for anyone wanting to go for it. You know, don't put yourself out out of the way to do something you don't usually do. For instance, if I was to start sniping constantly, which is not my forte at all, which I did mention in the um, introduction video, uh, it's way more stressful for me to play with. I enjoy playing with the sniper. I do enjoy having it. If I have a good game with the sniper, I enjoy it way more than having a good game with a red gun. Uh, but the ch you know they're ch very very you know uncommon. Like they're such a rare occurrence for me to happen. Just for the simple fact I'm not as good with the sniper, whereas I could you know go off with a red gun. You know at least once every single day at least you know or m multiple times a day it's one of them things i'm more comfortable with it i'm better with it it's going to just make make it making content more fun for me and hopefully produce more entertaining content even though i'm dying multiple times in a row here so i'd love to know what you guys think and what guys you content you guys would like to see whether to you know keep going with what i'm doing keep doing you know the, the normal content that i do which you guys seem to like anyway i need to mute these people because i'm gonna start talking then um or you know try something different go for the sniping clips and stuff i know i said i was gonna go for you know practice sniping all week and good with the sniper but let's say like you know a rare case scenario here if it did happen if i was to join phase through the sniping content i produced you know during the rc then it wouldn't be happy, it wouldn't be good for me because then I'd have to continue sniping. Or if people would, even if I didn't, if I grew my channel through the recruitment challenge and people are subscribing to my channel for the sniping content, they're going to expect me to snipe. And this is the point Moz was making, you know. Uh, they're going to expect me to snipe and 
when I start using red guns again in class sort of videos, are they going to stay? Are they going or are they going to unsub because they're not here for that kind of content? They're here to see some you know some sniping content, which you know isn't what I want to do. I I, feel, I prefer red gunning. I prefer you know showing OP class subs. I prefer you know war zone with the red gun. Everything you know it's just me. I just, oh my god, that's a pretty decent two piece. I don't know how that kid did not kill me on my right, but we'll take it anyway. It's one of them things, you know. It's in the lo it's good in the short term, it might help you get noticed a little bit more if you're you know, doing something interesting like that. Uh, but in the long run, is it really going to help? I don't know, and I'm missing every single shot there. Wow. And to be honest, I don't think FaZe are really interested in sniping content anymore. For that matter, like, it used to be the, you know, the thing, like, FaZe was a sniping clan. You know, if you wanted to be in FaZe, you had to be a sniper. But it seems over the years, the new recruits and stuff, let's take Swag and Nick Merckx for perfect example, just like, you know... They don't snipe, they never have been snipers, they're just absolutely nasty with a red gun, you know, they are really, really good players. And, you know, that's the kind of content I was wanting to bring to the table, you know, that's what inspired me, them kind of players. You know, dirty red guns, like, just absolutely annihilating people, you know, outgunning people. And that's probably what I'm best at. I'm obviously I'm not the best in the game, I'm not trying to say that, I'm not trying to say I'm as good as Swag or Nick Merckx either, because I'm not, because they're insane. But... That kind of content, you know, that kind of same like level is what I'm, you know, enjoy doing most, you know, getting good gameplays, just destroying with a red gun. Uh, so that's, oh my days, they just got destroyed. We'll take that lovely little four piece there. Oh my god, I'm going to get the fifth guy as well. Can we get another VTOL here? Maybe. No, I'm going to get taken out. But that's the, well, that was the discussion we was having, you know, it was uh, definitely something to consider. Um, because I was going to switch to sniping, but he completely changed my mind. And, you know, just be yourself. That's that's the main thing. Have fun with it. Don't go out of your way to do something that you're not, you know, just to impress people. Um, which is, you know, if you impress people, good, obviously. But you want to be happy doing it. You don't, you know, you want to be just something. Like like I said before, this guy in the window. Oh, my days. Oh, they're both jumping out the window on me. Don't put yourself out of the way, do something temporary, then you're just going to switch back after it's over because what's the point? You're just wasting your time. The people who found you for that kind of content aren't going to stick around because you're not doing it anymore. It's one of those things, you know, you've got to think in the long term, not just the short term. Uh, so doing what you're doing anyway, being like you, like, see if I keep doing the content I'm doing, I'm sure people will enjoy it. I'm sure people, you know, will notice me for that. Uh, whether it'll be get me into phase is another question. You know, it's so many people going for it. I'd love to know how many people have actually applied. Hundreds of thousands of people, 100% easily. You know, if not a million people, I would not be surprised if it's a million people. So the chances of getting in are slim. I don't know how they'll work it in looking at all the applications. You know, will I even get looked at? I didn't even see that guy. Wow. You know, will my friends get looked at? Will... You know, the bigger guys look get looked at. More than likely, the bigger guys will be, obviously. You know, I know Spiro's absolute beast on Warzone. He was an absolute machine in Blackout as well on Black Ops 4. He's going for it. You know, there... You know what I mean? There could be some guy who's an absolute beast. Will he even get looked at? You know, it's one of those things. You never know, but... Like people said, and there was a video uh, posted on Twitter. I can't remember who posted it now. Uh, by a phase member. I can't, I can't remember, but I do, I do watch him. It sounds fake as fake as fuck you know but I do I can't remember who it was though now saying that he didn't expect to you know for it to happen and then all of a sudden you know he was just doing he was a sniper by the way uh, and it just worked out you know he got noticed and it got him in like, you never know what could happen and that's the whole beauty of it you know there's no point in saying well I'm not going to get in I'm not even going to bother trying because you don't actually know. You know, anything can happen. You know, people are full of surprises. The life is full of surprises. Um, and like I said before, even if that's not the what comes out of this, you know, the main goal is obviously to join. But if that doesn't come out of it, you know, the growth, the support, you know, the whole process is just enough for me, you know, and it should be enough for you as well. Because um, it's going to be insane. It's super fun, giving you something to grind for. We all love a, gain, uh, a grind inside of the game, but having one to do with the game outside of the game, if that makes sense, is just on another level of enjoyment for me. Uh, definitely, you know, doing two things I love and grinding for something I love even more. You know, YouTube, Call of Duty in phase, is just, it's just nuts, you know. It's super, super fun, super, super motivating and inspiring, you know, to do better. Oh my god, how am I not killing that kid off the head glitch? Jesus, that would have been nice. Nice little VTOL to end this game here. 26 seconds on the clock. We've had a pretty decent game here as I have been rambling. Uh, probably not as good as I would have liked to, but hopefully I just got a little few things off my chest there. And my plans for the you know the RC 
going forward now. Um, a little change of plan from what we had previously. But it is what it is, and this grow setup is nasty. That is the main focus of this video. Try the grow out again, it's absolutely insane. Two seconds on the clock. Honestly, it's a beast, guys. How many kills did we get? 49 kills, I'll take it. The grow is the meta again. Make sure you try it out yourself. Okay, guys, unfortunately, this is going to be the end of the video. Make sure you guys do try out the grow for yourself again if you've stopped using it due to the meta change. Believe me, it's back. It's absolutely insane. Slaps. Honestly, it melts. But yeah, apart from that, guys, if you guys are new around here, make sure you smash that subscribe button. We're on the grind for phase five right now, baby. So make sure you smash that subscribe button. Make sure you drop a like if you did enjoy today's video. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter. Links for them, they're in the description below. But yeah, thank you guys ever so much for watching. I hope to catch you guys on the next one. Peace.